Okay, we're just sitting here in the parking lot waiting to go back to take a look at two 40 foot high cube containers that could be ours after today. How do you feel? Feeling good. Fingers crossed they're in good condition. Let's see how it goes. another video at the shipyard because we both had to get back to work and I've obviously changed into my comfy clothes but after viewing the containers that they had there we decided to pull the trigger on them and we bought two containers today Woo! Woo! it's super super exciting they're getting dropped uh next week already so we're gonna have them in our possession in a little over a week and it's super exciting. Uh, I think the coolest part about this whole thing so far is that when we first really decided that we were interested in building a shipping container home, we would uh, spot containers constantly, whether they were on semi trucks on the highway or sitting on people's land or sitting in a shipyard. And we drove by the shipyard in Northeast where we were today and saw all of these containers stacked together like Legos and we just lost it. We were so excited, we were like, oh, that's so cool. And then fast forward a year and that's where we bought our container from. So it's pretty cool to, for me at least, I think it's really cool that uh, life worked out like that for us. And yeah, soon we'll be able to share with you the inside, the outside, and all the work that's gonna go into cutting these babies up. Yep, stuff's about to get real.
are officially owners of two 40-foot high cube shipping containers and you can see them behind us here. We got them from a company local in Minneapolis, but we had them shipped down to Iowa and that's where we are now. Yep, in Iowa, my dad has a shop down here. He's an electrical contractor, so there's a big old shop, tons of tools, welders, chop saws, grinders, steel, everything we're gonna need to really fabricate these things out. So that's, that's kind of why we made the decision to ship them south before we actually ship them north again. Hopefully, we'll just be able to fabricate these things a little bit easier, have some more hands to help out when we need to do some heavy lifting. Yeah, so we're, we got them down here and we're super excited to get things going. Out and over. Over and out, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> 